Alright, what is going on ladies and gentlemen, it's VP here, welcome back to a little more of Nova Atis. Uh, I've been doing a little bit of work in between episodes, grinding a ton of tournaments, and uh, we have been rewarded. I don't know how doing a bunch of tournaments did this, but it somehow turned us from being ugly to good looking. And that is a win in my book. Um, it's not really that important of a trait, I don't think. Yeah, I mean, plus 500 influence when you marry someone. All right, uh, big deal. I don't think we're going to be marrying someone anytime soon, but hey, we'll take it. How do I look at that? K, Y, no, hmm. V, V, there we go. So we are loyal and good looking now. And uh, if I remember correctly, there's all, there's like a ton. Yeah, there are tons of different kinds of traits. So we are just starting to scratch the surface. Oh my God, look at this guy. Who is this? Earl Fredericus. Jesus. Oh, he has a bunch of bad ones. Disloyal, impious, incompetent, bad duelist, bad supplier. Wow. All right. All right. So, anyways, like I said, I've been doing a lot of grinding. 50. Oh, my God. I didn't realize that we had that much. 54,000 florins. And there is a reason for that, which we'll get into in a sec. First off, let's level Quinius up here. What are we doing with you? You've got the tactics. You got the engineer. We have spotting and pathfinding. Mm. You know what? Fuck it, man. Go ahead and <laughs> we'll upgrade your power strike. That's not a bad idea. And then, uh, uh, God, God, actually, other than that, I don't know what we actually want from him. We don't really necessarily need anything from him. Maybe first aid wouldn't be a bad idea. That way, if we get knocked unconscious, we still actually get healed up. Yeah, that is actually a good idea. I don't. I for, normally forget to do that in most series. Um, we're going to put all these points into firearms because <laughs> sooner or later, we want all of our heroes to be uh, rocking some boomsticks. All right, so, and then ourselves, we leveled up once, so boom, we can get intelligence up to 15, that's awesome. We'll max out the healing skills for right now, and then the next three levels, we're going to max out strength at 30, and then we'll probably switch back to uh, intelligence for the rest of the campaign. Maybe. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I know there's a way to get extra intelligence points besides leveling up in this. I'm, I'm just not sure how we're, if we're going to do it. You have to join a religion and then donate a bunch of money. But I don't know if I want to donate, or I don't know if I want to join a religion. I don't know. If we did, it wouldn't be serious, okay? Alright, so let's see. I did actually um, start another apprenticeship here because... Unfortunately, you have to go through the imprint, uh, the apprenticeship process with every single different town. Um, even if we wanted to open up another blacksmith, even though we're already a master blacksmith in over in Alderberg, we'd have to do it all over again in Zendar. So this time I'm doing, I'm making a dyer um, because we're actually making a decent amount of money off it now. Let me see if I can show that. Yeah, a decent amount of money off it. It's more like actually 1400 I think. And... And we actually get prestige points now um, for based on how much money we make every week. We get prestige from that, which is a little interesting. But um, anyways, today, what are we doing with all this money? You can probably tell by the title, we're setting sail to the new world. Or at least we're going to try to. The only way to do that is in Zendar. So let's see, where is the harbor? Let's check this out. We want to buy a new ship. Um... So let's see, it's most cost efficient to get a galleon. Alright, uh, there's maintenance on it, but meh, that's fine. We'll get a, we'll get a galleon. 7 Gs, we got that. We got that easy. Do we have enough food? Um, don't want to pull a Christopher Columbus and nearly have everyone starve before we get to our destination. No, I think we should be good. Oh my god, velvet sells for a ton. Yo, <laughs> if this whole dying thing works out... Um, we're going to be a very, very rich man. Ooh, hello. I forgot about all this shit. We got a new suit of armor and we didn't give it to any... Or we didn't give our old one to anybody. Um, I guess we'll give it to Rolf. Don't see why not. There you go. And then I'm pretty sure... Is that... that? One? I think that's the same that Quinius has. No, Quinius is actually a little bit better. Okay, cool. Perfect. So we can go ahead and probably... Well, we'll keep it for the for the time being. All right, let's uh, head out of here then. Let's see, do we set sail? All right, let's let's check this. <laughs> let's check this new world out. Um, I know we don't have the needed supplies for right now, but uh, we'll get it. We'll get them eventually. 
But we're just going to go to these different islands. We're going to check them out. And if we can start a colony today, um, which I don't see any reason why we shouldn't be able to, uh, that'd be great. That'd be a great revenue stream to have this early on in the series before we even before we even have a tiny little village. So if we can get this started, then we can start looking at becoming a lord, uh, you know, having a little village, working our way up, getting a castle. Um, also, supposedly, we can make our own castles um, in this mod, which is pretty cool. And I think they said, like, up to five of them, which if that's true, that's kind of fucking insane. We will definitely be checking that out if that is the case. Alright, let's see, what do we got here? Beach of Nova. Oh, there's some sea raiders chilling out there, too. <laughs> Alright, go ahead and land here, then. Let's see what we got. Alright, it produces spice. Interesting. We don't need that for right now, though. We don't want spice. We want either tobacco or gold. Those are the big money makers. How do I get out of here? Shit. Okay. Alright, I think we're good. Boom. <laughs> we have those. Oh, ooh, wait, hold up. What are these guys? Oh, shit. We got some actual tribal dudes in here. All right. All right. All right. Let's, uh, let's get into a little bit of a battle. Why not? See what happens. See what they got. Did the Sea Raiders join them? No. Oh, man. All right. That is, uh, interesting choice of armor there. And, uh, by choice of armor, I mean no armor. <laughs> that is very bold. Uh, whoa, hello. 22 Renown for this battle? These guys must actually be pretty tough. Holy shit, look at these guys. And we whiffed. Cool, 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 cool. That's nice. 47 damage. Yo, they must actually have good armor. Remember this stuff? Holy shit, our, our gun normally one-shots people. 320 experience? Oh my god. These guys are no joke. All right. Um, they're fucking up all of our guys right now. There's only one left. Slave driver goes down. We just delivered 86 damage and didn't kill one. How is that possible? Actually, we might have hit a horse, to be honest. Boom. There we go. 91 damage. That's a little more like it. Yo. These guys are for real. Ooh, 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 ooh. Duck him, boy. Duck him. Uh-huh. There's another one. Nice. All right. The Durger tribesmen aren't nearly as good. They're a little, sh little shrimpy looking. So, I've, uh, I've been thinking, I might actually edit the mod files and, uh, increase the number of bullets that you can have in a, uh, a quiver. It's not a quiver. I don't know. What, a pouch of bullets. Because 15 is just not enough. I might up it to, like, 30. And I'd up it across the board, so it wouldn't just be me. It'd be all the troops in the game would, would get that. Um, damn, back-to-back -back headshots. All right. All right. Two more shots here. Boom! Three headshots. Okay. Trifecta. Can we get the quad? Can we get the quad? No. Wow, only 25 damage. That was a little bit of a letdown, not gonna lie. Swooping back in. Boom. There's one down. Okay, the sword still goes to work on him. Good to know. Good to know. Ooh. Bait him. You baited. <laughs> these guys don't know. They're not used to these advanced battle tactics. To be fair, no one in Calradia is really ready for him either. We've been fucking up tournaments all over Calradia. They still haven't learned. By the way, got, for the first time, I actually got a uh, the legendary presence achievement um, in uh, in one of those tournaments. And apparently, there's one after that called the mythical presence. But I think we'd have to be fighting more people than we currently are, um, and we have to knock every single one of them out without anyone else getting knocked out in order to get that achievement. But I kind of want to shoot for it now. We'll see what happens. I'll, if if we end up doing a tournament, I'll be able to show you what I'm talking about by the legendary presence. It's actually worth a decent amount. If you can get it fairly often, it gives you like 700 experience. Um, which, this early on, you know, is, is not an insignificant amount. Alright, so, leveled up again. Boom! More strength. I love it. Um, we're gonna get pathfind... Uh, hmm. Pathfinding. Yeah, sure. That one. Cool. Alright. Killed all them. Um, do we want to kill these guys? 12 Sea Raiders. Um, we've got room for more loot. Okay, let's take them out. <laughs> Fuck it, why not? Why not? And one of you guys specifically told me in the comments that Sea Raiders are great for loot, so we'll check it out. Also, hey, we've got some... Uh, we should have unlocked a bunch of combat abilities here. So let's see, what do we, uh, what do we unlock here with 14 Intelligence? We can get Focus, um, and we can get First Aid. So 5 and 2. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, how are these... How are they doing? 
We're doing alright so far. Alright, one down and two down. Okay, well, hey, they killed somebody. Quinius, of course. <laughs> Not Rolf. Rolf doesn't know how to kill people. <laughs> Don't be silly. Alright. Turn it back around. A little bit of a drive-by. Reloading. Alright, archers. That's gonna... Well, I was gonna say that has to stop, but... <laughs> my uh, shitty aim would say otherwise. God damn it. Thank you. Oh, man, I like when the bodies go ragdolling like that. Mm-hmm. There we go. Ooh, ouch. Okay, he hit us back. Alright, let's just kill these archers by hand. Thank you. Oh, yeah, these guys actually do have a good amount of armor. Have we fought these? I feel like we have fought Sea Raiders before in this mod. I mean, they're no joke. They're no joke. Respect where it is due. But, uh, they're still gonna get this working. Boom. Nice. Only 33 damage. It's weird. This... Hmm. Maybe it's because we hit him in the leg sometimes? I don't know. Sometimes it does way more damage than normal. It's either like it does like, you know, 70, 80, 90 damage, or it does like 20, 30. There's no in-between. So it makes me feel like we're just hitting different parts of their armor or something. Alright, and we're gonna have to execute this last guy. How you doing? Hey, wait, wait a sec. Thank you. <laughs> oh, nice. I love it. I'm trying to get as much experience with it as possible for when the good stuff starts getting unlocked. I don't know if there is actually much better than this. Hmm. Yeah, I don't actually know how that works. If, uh, because I know, obviously, there's going to be more firearms out there once uh, the technology stages go up. But do th does the quality of firearms go up? Because we got in early. Like, theoretically, we probably shouldn't have what we currently do. Um, we only got it because we got, like, a black arms dealer who's, <laughs> like, centuries before his time. All right, let's see. What's this one? Island of Senja. Ooh, Ivory. Okay, what does it take to claim an island? 15 timber, 10 stone, and 5 tools. Okay, so that's actually going to cost us a little bit of money. Hmm. Okay, that's fine. I don't know how much ivory is worth. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Right, I'm not trying to go on any of these. I think, wait, hold up. I think this is actually like Aztec territory. No? Yes, it is. Okay, Aztec Empire. Alright, we're not at war with them yet. But for right now, we're just going to leave them right where they are. I have no interest in uh, battling with them. All right. Island of Alice. Okay, let's check it out. Okay, another ivory one. Not interested. Watch. You guys are going to tell me in the comments. So oh, VMP, <laughs> ivory is worth more than gold. Worth more than tobacco combined. Atst. I feel like we've... Been... This name is very familiar. Tobacco! Okay, we're going to want that one. Um, we know tobacco is worth like six six fifty uh, a piece. Um, so that's that's not too bad. That's not too bad. I don't know how much gold is worth though. That's the thing. New Praven. All right, we'll check this one out. Sugar. Okay, nah, we're good. No diabetes for me today. today the gods have decided oh, shit. 15 pirates just boarded us. This, this should be fun. This, oh my god, no, they have their own ranged weapons. They got their own firearms. We are in- Oh no, I just headshotted Quinius! I thought he was an enemy! Oh my god, no, 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 no! Oh wait, they don't know what they're doing. They don't know what they're doing. Keep this up. They're just running at me with their guns out. They're not even trying to swing. This is a bold strategy. I need to kill this guy. There's only one guy with his weapon out and I can't- it won't let me hit him. Okay, there's a couple guys with the weapons on now. Is there... Where can I hide? Hold up. Let me break through here. Maybe. Shit. Okay, well, we lost our shield now. Hold up. Let me get to this ladder, motherfuckers. Oh, no! It's a just-for-show ladder, damn it! Okay, there we go. Healed our wounds a little bit. That helped. Okay. Now we're in a... Okay place. No? Maybe? Damn it. I don't know if this is where we want to be or not. I mean, this is about the best that we're going to get, huh? Probably about the best that we're going to get. Uh, let's rage a little bit, too. What the fuck? Why'd you take out that? Ooh, it says battle one. Battle one? Are you serious? 
It said battle one. I'll take it. I'll take it. Well, now let's finish off the last couple of them. Back when we have our shield again. All right, we're going to go ahead and treat our wounds. Nice. 30 hit points. Oh, that's not bad at all. Boom. Sit the fuck down. Can't shoot Quinius this time if Quinius is dead. <laughs> Get the fuck off of me. Get the... Bro. Bro. Get off my dick, sir. Okay. He's down. He's down. What are some of the other ones we can do? Um, focus? Let's do focus. Oh. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> um, and then we're going to rage two. No? Okay, it didn't let me. That's weird. Alright, and then we'll get him. Boom. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. That's weird how it's doing that. Actually, you know what? I vaguely recall this whole battle one stuff. I feel like we've seen it before. Like, it, this is not the first time that has done that. Huh. Huh. Okay. Well, whatever. We'll take it. We'll take it. And we get... Oh, hold up. What the fuck? Stone of the Sun? 2.4 thousand. Okay, then. I thought we were about to get shit for loot, and then all of a sudden it was like, oh, just kidding. This is awesome. Alright, so let's see these different islands here. What do we got left? Okay. Some cocoa. I think that's what that was. Cacao. Isn't that Coco? Maybe that's not. Hmm. I'm not actually sure. Alright, let's check this one out. Fernandia. This one seems like a gold one. Cotton. God damn it. Oh, it's gotta be... Oh, watch. It's this one. I, you know what? I got a feeling it's this one. It's literally the farthest away it could possibly be. If you want to get gold, you gotta... Tra yep, Asmura. Yep, I already recognize the name. It's definitely this one, isn't it? Yep, gold. Alright, so what do we need here? 15 units of timber, 10 stone, and 5 tools. Alrighty. Well, let me go get that. Ah, uh, shit, we've been waylaid by more pirates. More fucking pirates. One down. Alright, good so far. Rolf is down already, of course. Bitch ass Rolf. Another one down. We're not gonna shoot Quinius this time. Stay alive, Quinius. Alright, he's down too. Alright, we need to hold. Here. We can't get surrounded. That's the big thing. Oh shit, he just shot right through us, huh? Luckily this armor is pretty decent. This armor is not bad at all. So far so good. Let's go ahead and pop some healing right now. Preemptive. So we can get the timer for it started already. Fucking these boys up, man. There's even more of them than last time. That's okay. We learned our lesson. We know how to fight. I wonder if you have different sized ships in your army if these battles are different, like you if you battle on different ships too. That'd be pretty cool if that was the case. I don't think it is, but if it was, that'd be pretty nice. Get the fuck out of here. Whoop. Ouch. Okay. Okay, okay. Gun away. <laughs> gun away. And gun back out. Boom. Last but not least... Let's pop it. Oh, wait. Nope. There's two of them left. I, oh, my God. How did we... Three of them left. How did I miss that? Get off me. Hey, motherfucker. Get off me. Bitch, you gay? Get off my dick. Son of a bitch. Get out of here. <laughs> Jesus. He's rubbing up on me and shit. Oh, my God. Another one. Jesus. I'd, I prefer if you just try to kill me, man. Come on. All right. We can hit this shot. Thank Christ. Oh, look at his body just go overboard. Timber, bitches! Timber. Look at all these ships. Oh my god. Can we just acquire these ships and sail them back? Me, Quinnius, and Rolf will each take a ship back and we'll, uh... Ooh, baby, man! You actually get some cool loot from these guys. What is that? Like a... What do they call that? Double-headed serpent. Alright. We are returning with gifts. Alright. I think there's like some jungle places you can explore as well. I'm not sure where those are. Those might be in the islands to the opposite side. I think those might be the islands like like over here-ish. Or maybe it's like in this area. Hmm. I'm not sure. I wish we could check out the Mithridian Empire, but uh, we're not actually allowed. <laughs> not actually allowed in there. 
All right, Zendar. Talk to me, baby. What do you What do you got? I'm gonna need everything that you got. Tools, 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 tools. They have zero tools. Okay, cool, <laughs> cool. Um, well, at least we can sell off all of this and make a pretty decent amount of money. All right, another four G's. Halfway done paying for our boat. Um, hmm, hmm. Do they have like? Stone at least? I don't, only, a, only a little bit of stone. We can get the timber from... <sighs> Shit, how much? 10, 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Oh my god. Um. Alright, we're going to have to sell some stuff off here. I think we have to get rid of our crossbow, which... Alright. Not really too big of a deal there. We need some more space, don't we? We don't have enough inventory spots. 15, 20, I think we have like 26 spare slots right now and we need 30 in total. So I guess we could just get rid of some, get rid of some of this and we'd be all right. I think so. Hmm. Not happy about it, but all right, we can go ahead and sell that off too. I can't even do anything with this tool. You just sell this tool. We'll get another tool eventually anyway. So we can just go ahead and sell it off. So we'll get five grand. All right, we should be close to having the amount that we need. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pick up a pickaxe. And then, all right, I guess we need to go to a mine somewhere, right? All right, let's check out this mine over here. We might not actually get the colony this episode. We might just have to start working on uh, getting all the supplies in order to get the set up the colony, but that's okay. So let's see, who owns this thing? Duca Reland of which castle? Etrosk? Is that what they said? Oh, hello. Mountain bandits. No, thank you. Oh, well, shit. Oh, shoot the fuck out of them. Actually, they just, they just weren't looking for us. That's cool, too. Who is the... Uh, what is this? Uh, da -da -da. Tell me more. Oh. Uh-huh. Oh, interesting. Fascinating. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're a dick. Alright, who are we... Fuck, who are we looking for? Um, Duca... Reland. Okay, so he's a Rodot guy. Okay. Um, hmm. Not sure where to look for him, actually. And shit. I just... Hmm. Literally just thought about that. I was like, I'm running back towards where all those mountain bandits are. Aren't I? Yep. Yes, I am. <laughs> yes, I am indeed. All right, let's do this. We're good. We're Gucci. This is a big-ass map. Yeah, what the hell? Why are these guys so far away? So, the more I'm thinking about it, because that battle end early thing comes up, huh, I think... Hmm... I think there might be a way for us to, uh, max out our agility. Hmm. I might have to do a little bit of experimenting around. I'll get back to you guys on that. It's something that we did last time that worked out very, very well for us. Hello. And goodbye- oh, good god, goodbye to me. Jesus. I'm gonna take a sledgehammer to the face. Ow, ooh, fuck, these guys, what? Ooh, baby, ow. These guys hate their Wheaties this morning. Holy shit. Like, we've had enough of you embarrassing all of our bandits. We're gonna fuck you up. That are like, this is just the A-team of the, of the bandit kingdom. The best of the best. Still slaughtering them, but hey. They're better than the other ones. Oh, oh. Another one down. And another one. And another one. Is that it? Pretty sure that's it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. Mm -hmm. It looks like that battle... Okay. So, when it tries to end the battle early, it only happens in sea battles. Oh. Oh. Oh, my God. We just nearly ran into some more bandits. I'm an idiot. All right. Running the other way. Let's find that fucking lord, wherever he might be. He's probably on a military campaign somewhere, which is not actually the worst thing. It means we don't have to bribe anybody just to get to his uh, throne room. 
Just to have him get pissed off at us when we don't bow. <laughs> uh, all right. Location. Duca Reland. Hawaha. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The well-known city of Hawaha. I'm assuming that's over here. Yeah, it is. Okay. We'll head that way. Jesus, so much effort just to get to this fucking mine. But this is actually, you know, the mines are actually really fucking cool. So I was going to show that at some point anyways. Um, Why do I feel like he just walked past us? Uh, he might not have. Please tell me there's at least a Rodok vassal here. Oh! Okay, at least he isn't inside that castle. Oh. Hey, Brelan, my man. How you doing? You just, you're going to watch that castle get taken out too? Same here. Oh, da -da 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 -da. I would like to acquire a charter for your mind. Uh-huh. 500. Thank you very much. Back to the mine. And here we are. Pink. Quarry stone. Oh, wait. Hold up. Uh, before we do, let's go ahead and equip. Oh, my God. I still have all this stuff on me. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. It happens. It happens. Um... Right, let's go let's actually go sell the stuff off at Yale and just so we have a bunch of uh spare uh slots. Ooh, lordly gauntlets. 13. That's the best in the game right there. But, but am I trying to drop 30 G's on that right now? This early on? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. Um tempting, but no. But no. Ooh, tell you what, do you have any tools? I saw okay, rusty tools, perfect. Oh, well-made tools. That's expensive. But we only need five of them, so I don't mind if we have to pay a grand apiece. Also, I think our blacksmith makes tools. So all we have to do is tell them to hold their supply for a little bit. We should probably do that. That's probably a smart idea. Okay. Well, hey. <laughs> when I when I think of it, I'll try to remember to do that in between episodes so we can start building up a uh, stockpile of all that. So... So, well, actually, we'll probably be headed back, back over that way to chop down timber from the forest nearby there. And then we then we can tell them. That should work. All right, quarry stone. Let's check out the mines. All right, you can quarry stone in three types of ore in the mine. Make sure to have the mining pickaxe equipped. Uh, ore exists as either iron silver or less occurring gold. You need to smelt ores by climbing the ladder of the furnace and interacting with the minecart. Have fun. All right, so this is the mine. Oh, I forgot about this. All right, so that's where we go to actually smelt it all. I don't know if I ever really figured out how to do that last last season. It was um, it was interesting to say the least. Not not sure if it was incredibly worth it, but it was interesting. So let's see. You get in here. You got all these destructible targets. You have some gold laying right there, but hey, you can't take that gold. You didn't mine it. You gotta work for it. You gotta work for it. So you bust it down a little bit. Uh-huh. I think we're hitting, like, multiple different rocks right now. Boom! Prestige points. Ooh, we can actually use those. Shit, we're trying to prestige again. Come on, let me... Where's the stone that I'm trying to hit right now? I'm just swinging at the ground here. There we go. There's another one. And I think that's it for... here. Oh, there's this thing right here. All right, we'll go ahead and take this one. We'll try to clear out the mine... And then I think, I want to say that, you know, iron, silver, and gold actually looks different than the stone. Like, it, you know, it looks like a, a vein of it. But I'm not 100% sure. Alright, so we got some more stuff. So oh! Is this gold? That looks like gold to me. <laughs> that looks like some gold to me. We might have to mine through all this stuff to get to it. But that looks like some gold. And if we can actually get some gold, that'd be a good way to find out how much gold actually sells for. Although, if I remember correctly, I think you need multiple ores to uh, get get some ac get an actual ingot to smelt an actual ingot. Not 100% sure. Is this? This has to be gold. We're hitting it, right? How much stone do we need? Are there like 10 or something like that? It's 10 stone and 15 timber, I want to say. Boom. Oh, pyrite. Fuck you, it's fool's gold. Damn it. Forgot that that was a thing in this mod. Oh, man. <laughs> now I'm actually a little disappointed. I thought we hit gold for the first time. Like, we just turned down the first corridor and we found some goddamn gold. 
Oh, I'm just disappointed. All right, I'll be back in a sec. I'm going to get a few more of these, make sure we got enough stone. Uh, if I find some iron or, you know, silver or, you know, some more fool's gold, uh, then I'll probably record that. But otherwise, I'll be back in a sec. So, uh, my pickaxe just broke. And, um, we have nine stone. God damn it. Ah, whatever. I guess we can just... I guess we can just fucking buy some. Alright, whatever. Whatever. Get me out of here. I don't want this. Get rid of this fool's gold, man. I don't want none of that. Boom. Alright. Yep, permanently lost. I, I don't know how, how I'll ever be able to deal with the loss of the fucking fool's gold. <laughs> Alright. Let's head over to the forest. Get a little more of that. How much, uh... How are we looking here? I forget. How much... Okay, we only need about 170 more. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. Alright, well, we'll head over here. Hmm. So, oh, uh, yes. Looters! Ooh, 27 of them. Alright, that's actually a decent amount. Should be... F oh, shit. Hey, there we go. Okay, we're good. <laughs> I realized I was like, we don't have a melee weapon. That might be a slight problem. Alright, I'm going to deal with these guys right quick. God damn, it's dark. Holy shit. Okay, does anyone know how to get blood out of armor? Because, um, we're going to need it, man. That was a lot of dudes. We, we just fucking plowed through them. Alright. Anyways, boom. Ooh, okay, this stuff is actually worth a decent amount of money is the funny thing. Perfect. Perfect. All right, moving on, moving on, moving on. Elderberg better have at least one one stone. Well, otherwise we can get it as Zandar. Yeah, it's not a huge deal. Are we moving here? Jesus Christ, you're slow. Pick up your legs, man. Ain't nobody got time for that. All right, here we go. Scoot on in. Ooh, 46 kthers. Ha <laughs> ha. No, no. <laughs> Absolutely fucking not. All right, let's so uh, uh, let's go to goods here. Do, 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 do. There we go. 13 hundo. Alright, they do have the stone that we're looking for. Um, so let's see. We got, we got the 10 stone. Uh, we've got two tools, so we need three more tools. And then... 15 timber? Was I counting wrong this whole time? We do not have enough space for this. Oh, shit. We are going to have to get rid of some of that stuff. Ah, lovely. Lovely. That's great. Um, should we just get rid of that now? I don't know. Maybe, probably. Um, all right. Let's tell him to hold back for this week and just keep it. Um. Okay, we don't have a stockpile, so I keep all the goods. Yep, there we go. Okay, that should be fine. And how much does it produce? Oh, it produces ten a week. That's really not bad at all. Shit, I feel like we could make more money if we were to sell that off. Oh, but then it costs us a bunch of money as well to... Yeah, okay, so probably not, probably not. Alright, whatever. That's fine. Um. Alrighty, let's go chop some wood. Do we have enough space in here for that? Wait. No. No, we don't have enough space. What was I thinking? Oh, I was thinking that if we, we had 10 of each, 10 timber and 10 wood. No, we need a lot more than that. Um... Do I level up? Do I level up because... Maybe we need to invest a point into inventory management. Then we might have enough. Shit. Um. I mean, I guess I could, like, get rid of this. But if we get rid of this, are we still even allowed in? Or we'd have to buy it again? I don't know. We literally have to go with no food and none of this. We literally have just enough inventory space that if we carried nothing else, we could do that. But our, oh my god, we'd be starving. Yeah, that would not turn out well. Um, yeah, I think we're gonna have to, we're gonna need to get some more inventory management. Fuck me. Alright, well, on second thought. <laughs> Oh, on second, how much more experience do I need? 11,000? Mm, that might have to wait for next episode. So I'll tell you what we're going to do instead is uh, we're going to spend this this 54 grand that we have. <laughs> um, 
Let's do we want to get property here? Why not? Oh, we can get another noble great house. Can't quite afford the town palace. We'll get hey, we'll get there. We'll get there eventually. But for right now, that should be good enough. And it might even rank us up. Boom. Oh, it's definitely gonna rank us up. Awesome. Rolfin leveled up too. We actually got some experience from that. Nice, good morrow. You've gained more and more power and prestige. Lords keep track on you. Welcome to the bourgeoisie. Oh yeah, baby. Let's check it out. What do we got here? So we need, honestly, not that much more. It's only 300 to go up each class. That's not bad at all. You entered a class of self-employed businessmen, uh, one of merchants in a class with, with a good outlook. Uh, fight harder, gather money, and the upper class welcomes you. Cool. Actually, am I looting out this? Or am I renting? Oh, I'm not renting out. I feel like I have forgotten to rent out a few of my residences now. Like, probably not... I Probably not during the episode, because you guys would have screamed at me in the comments. But I think, like, in between episodes, I might have bought one and I forgot. I might have to go check that out. <laughs> um, shit. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, I might have. Alright, tell you what. How long has this episode been going on for? Might actually be a good time to stop. Uh, I was not keeping track. Cool. Let's... You know what? We already fought with pirates. We explored the new world. I think we're... I think this is a pretty good place to stop. Next episode, we'll pick up. Um, I'll do a little more work in between episodes. Make some more money in tournaments and whatnot. Make sure that we level up so we can get some inventory management. And then that way, uh, we should have enough space that we can transport all the necessary materials to the new world and start building some colonies. So, as always, guys, leave some comments down below. Let me know what you're thinking about this series and all of the rest of the series that we got going on right now. Like I said, Fantasy Cal Radio, it's coming out Friday. And I think I'm going to do the thing where uh, for every 100 likes on an episode that you guys do, I immediately upload the next one. Uh, I think I might try to do that again. I haven't done that in a hot sec, but it's always fun uh, to see just how many likes you can get out in that first day. Um, I think we might do that. And I'm also really feeling the Orc Mage right now. Um, but I'm not. that's not set in stone yet. You guys may convince me. Anyways, as always, take it easy.